welcome to my channel and i'm back with you once again with another video of microsoft flight simulator as it is clear from the title of this video that i'm going to show you the shortcut keys to move around in the cockpit uh, so this video is going to be for the beginners who are at a very beginners level or um, they don't have an experience of any flight simulator they haven't done it before and they're trying it for the first time uh, so this video is going to be really basic i will be really uh, touching the basics and uh, and to be honest with you, uh, for a very long time, I also refrained from using uh, the shortcut keys because obviously there's so much you have to learn to fly the plane. And plus there are shortcut keys which you have to keep in your mind during the flight. So while recording the videos, um, in order to avoid any uh, goof ups, I used to avoid the shortcut keys. And I remember a few days back, there was this uh, pilot who actually commented on my video uh, in which I've shown you how to uh, change uh, the camera views. And he was like, uh, give a pilot a flight simulator on the computer and uh, make them confuse. So it, it's a very confusing thing. So I always try to keep things simple for even myself and for the people who are watching my videos. So right now I'm at Islamabad International Airport and uh, the plane that I'm using is uh, the PMDG 737-800. Um, um, you can cycle your view um, in, the, in the cockpit using the mouse. You press the right key and you can change the view and stuff. Uh, but I'm going to tell you something interesting uh, right now. So if uh, you you have a certain view and you want to change it uh, back to the uh, to to the normal view of the cockpit or the captain, uh, simply press press control and then space bar, and uh, the um, view will be reset. Similarly, if you press uh, control and uh, and while holding control you press one, uh, the view will change to EFS and MCP. You will be able to see it. Uh, with the pre control 2 uh, but just remember you have to press control 2 you know you have to keep on pressing it uh, the view will change uh, to the fms you will be able to see the navigation display which is over here and then the upper ecam and the lower ecam and uh, the navigation display for the co-pilot if you press 3 control and 3 um, it will be focused on the fms and uh, with control 4 the camera will move uh, to the pedestal with five you will be able to see the throttle and plus the flaps and the speed brakes and the parking brakes uh, with control five uh, sorry control six <laughs> control five was this and then with control six uh, you will be able to see the upper panel and uh, all the controls um, the front one and uh, with control seven you will be able to see the aft control panel which is at the back for the navigation iris uh, alignment and all other things for the oxygen dome light and everything uh, with control eight uh, you will be able to see the navigation display and uh, primary flight display this is the primary flight display and then uh, with control nine you will be able to see this view and with control zero uh, you will be able to see the cockpit like this as if you're sitting in the jump seat and if you want to reset your view you can press control and spacebar and the view, view will be reset so if you know these shortcuts it's very good during the flight because you will be able to change the views just uh, with this uh, uh, with pressing control and alternate for me as i was making youtube videos so it looks doesn't doesn't look really nice you know just just scrolling through the cockpit like this and then just moving around and so it's kind of a um a hectic thing to do you see so i'm still trying to remember <laughs> which keys to 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 press i hope while making a video there is no problem there is one more thing i would like to tell you that if you press n uh, the view will be uh, from the outside you can switch between the the, the cockpit view and um, the view of the plane from inside now one more thing i'm going to tell you is uh, how to move uh, how to um, basically move the camera within the cockpit like your view is fixed but if you want to look left and right up and down how you will do it if you press shift and the arrow keys your view will be moved left and right okay let's press control and space bar uh, one more time so if you just only um, um, press left and right key the camera will move like this up and down but if you're holding shift then you will be able to look left and then you will be able to look left and right like this and then control space bar and your view will be reset similarly if you're in the uh, outside view you can press the shift key and then you can just press the left or right key or up and down key to see 
the plane it's very nice during the flight it's um, it's nice to have this kind of a view and if you want to reset the view press f and it will just go back at the tail and one more thing if you press control and uh, arrow keys up and down the view will quickly go towards different four positions this is the if you press uh, control and then the down key uh, you will see the front of the plane with control and uh, right key you will see the right side of the plane similarly left and then uh, the top of the plane with an up key and if you press end you will go back into the cockpit so this was a very short video that i wanted to make and show you guys how to cycle um, different views within the cockpit hopefully this was a useful video for you if you've got any questions you can ask me in the comment section if you want to add anything to this video the comment section is there for, for you with this i would just like to end my video thank you very much for staying with me have a nice day hope to see you soon